fur, it's cold. Hachoo! Yuck, my nose is running. I'd better go catch it. <laughs> Isn't this one lonely place? The North Wall. So deep in snow, I haven't seen any other Pokemon for a while either. Do you think they're all zombies? Oh, what's the matter? Well, what's that? Bye bye. What was that? It looked like a Pokemon, but... Did I imagine that? No, I don't think so. I'm sure there was somebody there. I wonder what they were doing in this lonely place. I guess thinking about it won't help us. We should keep moving. Oh! Fat Pack, look! See that? Those trees are frozen! It's Christmas! Looks pretty, but it must be harsh there. Oh, we don't have a choice. We have to get through this place. It will be horribly cold. I'd rather not go if I didn't have to. But hiding out in this area isn't the answer either. We can only go forward. We'll just have to keep our spirits up and keep going, Fat Pack. Fat Pack, are you ready? Which way should we go? Again, I can take the snow path. That's just going to lead me back here. So, into the frosty forest. Okay, let's go. It's going to be freezing cold, but let's try our best. That was weird halfway through the dungeon. Did anyone else notice that? I did. Oh well. What what's the worst could happen? Let's keep going. guys. We sure have traveled far into this forest. I think we'll be out if we can get through this place. Whoa, 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 Huh? Fat Pack, did you just say something? No, I don't, I didn't think so. I thought I heard a voice. I must have imagined it. Turn back. You shall not who, who is there? 
I've never seen Lord of the Rings. Yes, you have, TK. You are forbidden to pass. I actually don't know if TK's seen it. If you persist in trying to pass, then so be it. But you shall not pass. Oh, it's too bright. The ice around us, it's reflecting this light. Oh, TK, you and your plight. I am Articuno, the Wanderer of Ice. You know, I only just noticed now that I think about it. You know how the birds are like Articuno, Zepdos, Moltres, Uno, Dos, Tres? Let us begin. Uh, you know how they're Uno, Dos, Tres? They completely do this out of order. Fine, if you want to stay there. Oh, crap, he's at double speed. That's right. Yeah, TK, you get him. So Articuno, I'm not... I mean, I was less concerned about Moltres, but Mol the Moltres fight was a little bit tough. This, though, I missed a lot against it, and I just seemed to not be able to stop hitting. But both TK and I resist... Oh. I still have two Reviver Seeds. I'm gonna end up losing one here, probably, unless I get super... Or TK does that, that works. Man, this fight, compared to the Moltres fight, so much luck. I have all the luck right now. And that's the end of TK, I think. Oh, he just closed to death. At this point, let's try and finish him. Why would you use that, TK? Let me just make sure. I have... Yeah, one left. I can work with that. I should be okay. So long as I can hit occasionally. Is that a PP? Some of this. Or not. Good job, TK. Woot. Please, Articuno, we have to get through, no matter what it takes. Please let us pass. You shall not pass. He's even doing the pose. I should I should like post edit commentary in editing, put a staff in his one of his wings and be like, you shall not pass. Why? Why can't we pass? The frigid forest is there. It has warmed considerably in recent times. Well, warmed up? I'm still freezing. The flow of frigid air has been disturbed in the forest. Snow has started to melt. Snow is melting. Snow that has never melted before. Oh, even the never melt snow? This has never happened. Even once. Then you appear in the forest. Is this not your doing, Charmander the fire type? Well, we don't have anything to do with that. It's a, it's a coincidence that my tail's on fire. Please, Articuno, hear me out. It isn't our fault that the snow started melting here. It's not just here. Natural calamities are taking place everywhere right now. The forest frigid airflow wouldn't have would have been disturbed even if we hadn't come. Is that all? You expect me to believe that? Wah! Enough of your foolish talk. Prepare for your end. Stop it! Uh, Absol! There is nothing false in what they said. Calamities are indeed occurring in nature everywhere. Is... is that true? Yes. I have the ability to sense natural disasters. The calamities taking place now are of special nature. I've never experienced such before. So there are calamities besides this. Fine. I will choose to believe you. You may pass. Articuno! However... What? You must try to prevent the calamities from spreading. I'm counting on you. Yep, we promise, Articuno. So he goes from, you shall not pass, to, you are my champions. Whew, that was too close. Thank you, you saved us. Rather than saying thanks, focus on stopping the calamities before they worsen. If they are left unchecked, worse will befall us. My instinct warns me so. Oh. I sense the terrible power of the natural calamities. 
I was led here by my feelings of foreboding. I think it would be best if we combined forces. I will join you. Huh? You will? Really? Really. To put an end to the calamities, cooperation is vital. Let me lend you my powers. Sniffle. Thank you, Absol. Da -da -da. Yes. Oh man, I know exactly his name. I need a new. Oh wait, right. They're just here. Na 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 na. I hope I have enough letters. One more. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, it fits. And so, after getting through the for the frosty forest, Fat Pack's team headed further north. The more they advanced, the harsher the conditions became. Surely they would reach the wall soon. No, I'm not gonna end it yet. We can go a little while longer. The icy mountain path seems to go on forever. We've walked a long way here. TK looks exhausted too. We've been running all this time out of desperation. What's in store for us ahead? Find out next. No, I'm not. A <laughs> I just said I'm going farther. <laughs> Perfect time, though. Am I right, guys? Burr, this is too cold. There's nothing but snow now. The scenery's been the same for a while. I wonder if we're really making progress. Hey, Fat Pack. I was thinking. I think we've come to a place that's empty except for us. I have this feeling there's nothing ahead of here, even if we keep moving. I'm getting exhausted. We too. What's going to happen to us? I'm sorry. I said something stupid to frighten you. There isn't any point in wondering about what might happen. Not after coming this far. Even though we don't know what's ahead, we'll only know by pressing on. Don't worry, there's got to be something ahead. I have faith in you, Fat Pack. That's what brought me here. And that's not changing. I still have faith in you. I'll keep going wherever you go. Yes, TK, trust me without a doubt. Fool. I have... Uh-oh, indigestion. What? What was that? Oh, God. Nausea, heartburn, indigestion. Upset stomach, diarrhea. Fat pack, you need Pepto-Bismol. Finally. Finally, you have arrived. Someone? Someone is talking to me? TK? No, this isn't TK's voice. It's too girly. This voice. I've heard it somewhere. Finally! You have arrived! I've been waiting for you. G gardevoir I am so glad. Finally we get to meet. You're... what? Fat Pack, are you tripping out again? I come into your house sometimes when you're asleep and see you tripping out. Are you tripping out again? I cannot be seen by others. I'm your personal trip. A little farther ahead, there is a jagged mountain range topped by Mount Freeze. Inside its peak, Nine Tails lives. Nine Tails? Nine Tails awaits your arrival. Beware! Oh, what? Hey, Fat Pack, Fat Pack, what's the matter? What happened? And so TK, and so Fat Pack relays his trip to TK and Zalmithius. Oh, so something like that happened. Gardevoir appeared to you? That's why you were looking so stunned earlier. Sometimes tripping is really useful. It told us Ninetales is ahead. I wonder why Ninetales lives in this cold place. Sniffle. I'm a fire type and I'm even I'm cold. I don't even care about the text anymore. I'm just ad-libbing. We'll meet Ninetales and get the truth. We'll finally get rid of the suspicious of the suspicions others have about you, Fat Pack. Awesome. Choices. Listen, Fat Pack. I honestly, I don't know Okay. I don't know why they give you choices if the choices are the same. I'm just saying. It's only natural that you would be scared of meeting Ninetales, Fat Pack. You're a monster inside. And Ninetales knows it. I can understand how you could think that. 
But that's impossible. You're not that human, I'm sure. Hmm? Well, there was a time when I had some doubts. But now, I, I wonder why. I really don't know why. But it's alright. Fat Pack, you're a really good sort. You know, before, when I first got the idea of starting a rescue team, I met you in the tiny woods, Fat Pack. Now I think about it, there was something different about you. It's strange, isn't it? But Fat Pack, I believe in you. Anyway, Fat Pack, let's go and blah blah blah, you're long-winded. So I ended up getting, first of all, I'm storing these plain seeds. Anything else? The tract, I don't really need. I'm already attractive enough. And let's get rid of some of these orange berries. I don't need that many. But earlier, I got secret power. And I was very happy to see that because I know what I'm using it on. Hi, Fat Pack. Are you ready? All set. Where should we go? Once again, we have the optional snow path, but I'm just going straight to Mount Freeze. But before I do, I want to mention, I am going to use that secret power TM on Absol. I saw it and I'm like, ooh, spicy. That's going to be useful. finally arrived! This is the summit, isn't it? I wonder where Ninetales is. There they are. I've spotted Fat Pack. Alright, I see them. Dad! It's about time we finally caught up to you. We, your fugitive axe dragged us all the way out here. Pipe down, Tyranitar. We can finally settle things here. I can barely contain myself. I'm itching for a fight. TK, don't think badly of me. I don't know how to show mercy. Fat Pack. I didn't wish for it to end in this conclusion. But this, too, is fate. The role of a rescue team is to bring peace 
We will crush you with every shred of our power. Get them. This is a good fight. Cease this at once. What? Nine tails. What? Nine tails? That's nine tails. The legend, it was real. It's nine tails. Nine tails? Cease fighting at once, Alexam. They are my guests. Tell us, Nine Tails, who was the human that appeared in your legend? No, even before that, was the legend itself a true event? Depending on your reply, I may have no choice but to eliminate them. Whether they consider my curse to be a legend or not, I care not. However, it did happen. Many years ago, I tried to lay a curse on a human. It was then, however, that Gardevoir, the human's partner, dashed in. It selflessly bore the full brunt of the curse meant for the human. Then the human did a selfish and cowardly thing. They abandoned Gardevoir and fled. The human eventually became a Pokémon, transformed into a Pokémon the human. The human lives on. And that hum human would be? Who, in the, who is the human that you speak of? That pack. You may relax, it is not you. Just now, what did you say, TK? Stop, stop gloating, TK. Fat Pack is not the human that appears in the legend, that is what I said. W what What's happening to me? Are you evolving, TK? You are level 18. I'm too tensed up to move. Oof, oof. TK, you're scaring me. Deep breaths, in, out, in, out, in, out. Oh, wow, I feel fantastic. It's because you did calisthenics, TK. But, what, TK, you're scaring me. What are you doing? That's great. I knew that Fat Pack wasn't involved. I knew it. There's no way that Fat Pack would do those terrible things. I have another thing to say. It is true that I foretold of the world's balance becoming unstable. However, that human becoming a Pokemon and the world's balance are not linked in any way. The cause of the natural calamities, it exists elsewhere. Hey, you. You were wrong. You were wrong to hound and harass Fat Pack. TK, there's there's bigger, bigger fish. I apologize. We're sorry we got worked up by that Gengar. No. I suspected Gengar right from the beginning. Fat Pack and my son don't look like the treacherous type. Ha ha ha. If only that were true. But I must say, you are to be commended for prevailing through this cruel journey and discovering the truth. Impressive, Fat Pack. Haha, <laughs> excellent. I knew I was right. Huh? Oh, by the way, but wait. Then why did Fat Pack turn into a Pokemon? I understand that Fat Pack isn't the human from that legend. Then how do you explain him becoming a Pokemon? Fat Pack, who are you? Wow, the ground's heavy, heaving. Quack! Earthquake! Stop it, Tyranitar! No, it's not him. The world's crust is shifting. The natural calamities are worsening. And s the shifting of the ground. It will awaken the beast that embodies the ground. The beast that slept deep underground. Groudon will be awakened. What? Groudon is rising. Groudon? What is that? What's a Groudon? A legendary Pokemon that has been spoken of only in myths. It is the Pokemon that raised the land masses and created continents. It is said to have taken to sleep after catastrophic battles with its archenemy, Kyogre. If Groudon were to get loose, there would be chaos. It must be stopped. We will go. We'll go too. No, you must remain behind. Groudon is far more powerful than any Pokemon you have faced. Leave it to us. That's how it goes, kid. You go back to your rescue team base for a well-earned rest. Don't worry about us. We didn't get our gold rank that easy way. We'll get the job done and we'll be back before you know it. Fine. We're off to quell Groudon. Dun dun. But I'm a water type. And thus... Alakazam's team made their way underground to quell the awakened Groudon. Meanwhile, cleared of all suspicion, Fatpack's team put an end to their long and arduous journey. 
and return to their welcoming rescue team base. This has been Fat Pack. I hope you've enjoyed the On the Lamb week here with Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Red Rescue Team. I'll see you next week. Bye-bye. <laughs>